Hello everyone. This is the park area. Yes, I am. There. If you can see that. And feels great. So I just I just felt like, you know, coming to the park today and talking about I guess what you call love or God for and probably a ramble on for, you know, an inordinate amount of time. But if you have to go, go ahead, shut the video off and go on with your your events of your day. Um, I love you very much. So, and even if you don't aren't interested in talking about love or God, you could just like in, take imagine you're taking a walk, you know, and you're just like walking through a park. It's pretty cool. Uh, so let's see. So I think a big thing with a lot of people that worries them is they think that God won't forgive them. And I am pretty much 100% sure that that's impossible. God's nature is forgiveness. And Mother Earth's nature is forgiveness. She is an unconditionally loving being of the cosmos. You know, she's like an angel, except she's like you know, very much, like, advanced, you know? Like, some angels, you know, like, angels are loving, you know? So it's kind of like people have this misconception that somehow there's something that they could do that could possibly, you know, not be forgiven or could be, like... Sorry, there's, like, shade everywhere. I gotta, like, keep turning. Like, they could somehow do something that would you know, like, revoke your privileges, you know, of love from the universe, which is the most ridiculous thing, you know? Um, so, I'm here to tell you with certainty that, uh, you, you are forgiven, you know, of everything, you know? And if Jesus was here, he'd say the same thing. You are forgiven. I love you, you know? Um... And, uh, so, I think that's the first step in connecting with God, you know, I mean, you could say, a lot of the times people think that they, I feel like they, they block themselves subconsciously, you know, because God is, you know, really wants to connect with you. He really, um, you know, wants you to, to be... Um, at peace, and he wants you to be happy, you know, and he created this for you, you know, he created existence for you, you know, and, um, I just feel like saying a quick prayer about this real quick, I feel like there's some people in here that might have, like, anxiety that gets lodged in their back, you know, and I went for a massage today. And at first it was kind of rough, but then I realized that that's kind of what I needed. Like, this woman who was strong to just, like, lay it on me, you know? And it was great. Oh, yeah. It was good. Uh, I won't go into detail about that. But it was awesome. It was awesome. And I feel like there's people in here that, that could use a massage, but for now I feel like let's just say some prayer about that. You know, like, Lord... We need your peace, we need your healing, and your grace right now. Anyone who is in need of this, just go ahead and raise your hand and say, me, right? I actually do need it too, my, 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 my neck and my back. Oh, I kind of feel it, you know? So Lord, I feel, or I pray that um, your healing and your guidance and your peace, but right now mostly just your healing can come into our backs, come into our our rib cage, our intercostal muscles, the muscles that are in between the ribs. I feel like some people just got relaxed right there because I feel like that's where you guys are holding 
tension a lot of the times in your physical form, you know, you're feeling like that. And uh, just let it go, you know. God loves you. And I know that some of these things are complicated and they're not just physical, but for now we just pray for the physical and we say, Lord, I pray that you come into our bodies and you relieve the tension and the stress on a physical level for us. In Jesus' name I pray that the Holy Spirit, which is capable of healing anything, can come into our bodies right now and relieve our stress and our anxiety. In Jesus' name, Amen. And let's see. I don't know, I'm just really enjoying walking in nature and transmitting love to you in the form of words. You know? Like, I feel like, oh, pretty robin. There's a beautiful bird on this tree right over here. I want to show you it. Okay, God, everyone, let's pray that this robin does not fly away. And I pray that God will let us approach this robin without fear and love. As soon as I said fear, the bird flew away. <laughs> Shouldn't have said it. Should have just walked up. He flew to the other tree, but I don't know if you can see him. He's over here across the street. 